Hey guys, James Baker here, and uh, today we're going to be looking at the Premier League badges of the 2021 to 22 season, and we're going to be rating them from 1 to 10, depending on how terrible or how good they are. So without further ado, let's get into it, and don't forget to subscribe for more. So first of all, we have Norwich City's badge. Now, I quite like this, they've stuck with this sort of layout for quite a long time and uh, just looking on it, it's, it's pretty good I'd say, but overall just because it's the badge it's not appealing to my eyes, maybe to yours but not to mine, uh, I've got to say a 5. So now we're looking at Newcastle United's logo. Absolutely brilliant, this badge. Um, I've got to give it a 7 out of 10. Um, I mean, it's been used quite a lot over the years. Not much has changed to it. And I think the traditional look just... It, it's fantastic. 7 out of 10, definitely. And now with Burnley Football Club. Absolutely brilliant badge. Um, I think it's quality. You know, everything about it, it's... It's nice. It's nice to look at, um, especially in high definition. And uh, yeah, I absolutely love it. But, you know, I'm going to give it an 8 out of 10 overall. Now for Watford, brilliant badge. I actually like, quite like the colour scheme, the red, the black, the yellow. Absolutely brilliant. Smashing it at 9 out of 10, I'd say. And for Leeds United, hmm quite like it, it's pretty fresh, nice looking, definitely a mm, 8 out of 10 I'd give it. I think for Everton maybe, you know, maybe a 6 out of 10, it's a good badge but it, I think there's something about it that needs to be freshened up, I couldn't tell you what, but maybe, I don't know, maybe it gives it more of a modern look but still keep that same Everton vibe for the club badge. Now following up to Brentford, I quite like this badge. Plain, simple, got a nice B in the middle of it. Absolutely fantastic to be fair. I'd have to give that a 10 out of 10, that badge. And we come into Southampton FC and uh, I really don't like this badge at all. Um, it'd be good, it's good for the club obviously, but nah, I'm going to have to rate that quite low, I really hate it, I'd say 4 out of 10, I'm sorry, 4 out of 10. For Aston Villa, um, I quite like the badge actually, I can't lie, uh, it's, it's nice to look at, um, and the lion, it just sticks out, really. And, uh, yeah, fantastic badge. But I'm only ever going to put it as far as 8 out of 10. And to Crystal Palace. Um, I quite like the badge in general. I've liked it for many, many years of knowing the club. And uh, the eagle is just fantastic where it's placed. And the Crystal Palace underneath. Yeah, I'm going to have to give that a 10 out of 10 for being extraordinary. And now we move on to Brighton and Hove Albion. The kits, I'd definitely rate a 10 out of 10 because I absolutely love them. I don't know whether that's the same rating on the other video where I did the ratings of the kits or not, but that's not important. It's all about the badges. And this badge, definitely 10 out of 10. Now with Leicester City's badge, I quite like it to be fair. I'm not going to lie. It's, it, it looks fresh. 7 out of 10. Now, hold up, hold up, it's Wolverhampton Wanderers. And this is a fantastic badge. Plain, simple, not too much to it. 9 out of 10. And now, Manchester United's logo. Absolutely fantastic. I love this badge. Obviously, I'm a United fan. Um, so, yeah. 10 out of 10, I suppose. i got to say. Not long until the end of this now. But... Tottenham Hotspur, I've always loved this badge, 
Um, plain, simple, absolutely brilliant. Gotta say 10 out of 10, to be honest. Now, this one, fantastic. West Ham United, you've got a fantastic badge, to be honest. Quite like it. Pretty modern, pretty fresh. There you go. It's going to be a 9 out of 10, though. Now, for Arsenal, um, pretty original. They've kept the same badge for quite a while now. Um, it's going to be a 6 out of 10 for me, though. Now, as much as I am against the club, because Man United are big rivals of Liverpool, um, they actually do have quite a nice looking badge when you see the formal badge that they use. Um, I've got to say, it's quite top end to be honest. Um, I'm going to say 8 out of 10. And now for Chelsea quite like the badge they've actually kept this sort of badge for many many years now um but it still has that ring to it it's got to be a nine out of ten though and now finally the manchester rivals manchester city now their new badge that they've had for a couple of years or so now or a few years now you know quite special it relates back to the old one that they used to have which was back in the day before they changed it to like that giant bird sort of badge um it's quite bold but seven out of ten because it doesn't make it that great so yeah anyway guys um now before we do go into the end of the video i would like to let you know that there is still a sale going on at bonfire.com over on my online store which is the 2021 clothing and james bacon merchandise store um and there's a lot of clothing to choose from there's also now face masks in regards to obviously the coronavirus and omicron of the time of this being recorded and bags and there's mugs so if you want a coffee in your morning and you want something like that then that store's definitely for you. So the link will be in the description for that. And so will be my SoundCloud as well. My SoundCloud will be in there. Um, my Audio Mac page, which is another social platform for music. And uh, so you can upload as many songs as you want. And also, yeah, don't forget to subscribe. Uh, like this video if you enjoyed it. And don't forget to give a, com a comment as well if you want to. Um, and yeah, share the video as much as you can. Share the channel and it'll be much appreciated, guys. And just before we shoot off from this video, I'd like to give you a challenge. If you can get this video to 100 likes, yes, I said it, 100 likes, then I will continue doing these type of videos for you. And if you enjoy watching them that much, then please keep sharing these videos, including this one. And then maybe there'll be more content just like this. Not just music, not just gaming and banter. It'll be a bit of ratings and stuff like that to do with football in general and uh, it might make the uh, channel more enjoyable too so if we can get this to 100 likes I'll continue these type of videos because then I'll know whether you like them or not so uh, yeah I mean even if you didn't like this video and you stick a like on it that'd be much appreciated too and I'd be thankful and bouncing off the walls happy for that to happen so, uh, yeah, thanks for the support, guys. And, yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye for now.